Today on with you we are looking at Trials Evolution for the Epa 360 which you can find over on Epa Live Arcade for $15 or 1200 Microsoft points. Well for anyone who have not played Trials in the past with Trial AD, Trial is pretty much made up of you going through distant optical courts as a motor quad wider and having to figure out how to get the point A to point B in the quickest time possible to unlock metal to go throughout the game. The only catch here is the trial is not as simple as it might seem. Trials seem to very lovely like going on more of the crazy side, especially in Trial Evolution, with the level of playing level from Light and Limbo or jumping between Sky Islands and going to caving in mountains and it pretty much anything you can imagine it more than likely is in trial evolution or at least in the mini games anyway because a lot of the mini games are made up of such games like marble madness or mental explosion man and see how far you can make it on one tank of gas the mini games are very unique and way more unique than they was in trial hd with now with multiple game types you can play within this to keep you busy outside the main quill mode. With the main quill mode mainly made up of you going from plate to plate completing a couple of trials for each area you in to on bronze, silver, and gold medal, which in return will be posted on the leaderboard for your time for your friend to compete against you and also the medals are also used as for unlocking later stages. And every couple of stages you will unlock a license tra challenge which is made up mainly of tutorial teaching you how to do the ins and outs and the more complex stuff in trial since trials at all physics baits and you only have technically three buttons or four if you count the joystick of leaning back and forward and then gas and brake and teaching you the ins and outs of how to get past some of the more complex things later on down the road and if you complete them you will unlock more motorcycles you can control and on the motorcycle side it, every motorcycle you unlock is fully elite me not mechanically but look wide editable you can go in and change the paint cordial for every inch of your bike while along with your uh, actual motorcycle wider also. You can of course buy now t-shirt helmets and outfit for your character which is not much here and they all look fairly similar but at least you can actually change the color of it and kinda try to make your wider a little unique any if it not the most deep side of it. And then bringing over your custom wider and bike into the actual multiplayer is made up of mainly a time trial with you comp competing against your friend for top time goals. You can do that very similar to how it was in SSS, uh, the recent SSS, where you can court with ways to get your friend ghosts and figure out exactly how do they do some of the more complex things and get through the level as quickly as they do. Why along with you can actually have multiplayer here which you and three other wider will be on the same track, racing to the very end, sadly and not really anything unique here out of the gate. And mainly the same old jump and continue on war type of deals. And if you do in local co-op, anytime you fall you will weep on in the same screen as your friend which will keep keep the weight fairly interesting and stop being one sided but sadly they're not the same for the actual online multiplayer which is working checkpoint system very similar to the actual game itself so in many cases you can quickly fall behind and just straight out lose and after a few heats each character will give him point based on where they are in the overall weight which will decide the final winner overall and then trial also has something that is very unique to itself. It of course now you have a fully in-depth level editor to the point of you have a massive landscape already made and you can go in and to well you want your event to actually take place. It's no longer picking from static alignment. A whole island is up to you. While on to the ability of building your own random islands and towns and stuff in the sky or changing the territory that is out of default, like way out lowering, way mounting, deleting buildings, and having multiple items in the game you can actually use to make more complex ramp, weather, lighting, and so on. And then in the 
more complex editors and you get two editor and the light editor and the complex editor and the complex editor you will get asset to such thing of uh, triggers and targets and making prefab for anyone who are familiar with PC game modding or game design. Some of these things might seem very familiar to you and in many cases this is what makes this editor very unique. This is the most user friendly and most complex editor I have actually seen on a console. And this is where the main draw become from because since you have a online network of your friend right along with a in-game web browser more or less a web browser which you can go through and download people tracks right now and actually compete in leaderboards on the unique tracks and the tracks are made up of tagging and you can sort for username if you have a friend that have level and you want to find it straight off it is so smooth and fantastic across the board when you come to this and any if you get to the point of trial where you beating your head against the wall because it's only a matter of time before it happened you have all the downloadable level you can play to keep you interested or you can make your own but on the difficult setting of the actual single player trial you have way more level than you did in trial AD and the uh, actual difficult it scale a much better and take longer to actually get to beating your head against the wall and then return actually give you more feel like you're accomplishing more within the game itself so overall i can't help but recommend trial for anyone who is interested in level design competing with your friends or just playing a solid game across the board any of the soundtrack could probably get on your nerves a little bit if you're not a fan of rock rap 90s goodness so overall i give trial evolution a five out of five.